Happy New Year, everybody. My name is Eric Creel, and welcome to the Creel Studios. I here today to do my ranking all 12 months of 2022, which is least to best. So, without further ado, let's get start on this ranking. Starting to the ranking on the number 12 spot at the bottom, so which is my least favorite month of 2022. Well, it's not the worst month of 2022, but it's still my least favorite month of 2022. And that is March 2022. Although at least it's better than March 2020 for sure, but still an underwhelming month since I'm not a fan of March 2022. Yeah, especially my grounding fret my temper problem and the scariest news ever that Will Smith slapped Chris Rock in the face at the Oscars. What a scary news ever made. And the only good things that I like was Turning Red was premiered on Disney Plus and I've been binge watch regular show for the first time and close enough which is one of my favorites and my honorable mentions of my favorite shows of all time. And the celebration of the movies like the 20th anniversary to Ice Age, the 3rd anniversary to Warner Park, and the 15th anniversary of Meet the Robinsons, and the 3rd anniversary to Vic and Val, aka Victor and Valentino. So, and that's March 2022. My least favorite month of 2022. At number 11, January 2022. January 2022 is decent. The only best thing that came out in January 2022 is Frozen Fang Studios birthday. That's really good. And I have free temper problems. Just free. But eh, that's okay. January 2022 is a decent month. They have underrated movies like Hotel Transylvania, Transform Mania, and The Ice Age, Adventures of Buckwild. If you do not like these movies, that's fine. I accept your opinion. So, and that's why I put January 2022 for my number 11. And I almost forgot about my family adopted a puppy. That looks awesome, isn't it? So, let's continue to the number 10. At number 10 is September 2022. This is better than January 2022, but the only one temper problem from September 2022 is my confusing from my fixing my internet problems for my Nintendo Switch and the time zone. But thank goodness I already figured it out with my parents. And that sounds good. And so does my birthday on September 5th, 2022. What an awesome birthday presents. If you have not seen my birthday update, check out for my YouTube video for my YouTube channel. And including the movies that I saw on IMAX was Jaws and James Cameron's Avatar in IMAX 3D. It looks awesome. That's September 2022 for my number 10 spot. Coming in at number 9 is February 2022, aka the best month for sports, is the Beijing Winter Olympics, the Super Bowl, and last but certainly not least, Daytona 500. And oh, and I almost forgot about only good things in March 2022 was the Beijing Winter Paralympics. That it looks pretty good, but enough talk about that. And, and I have no anger problems in every nine months of my favorites of 2022. Oh boy, this has got to be awesome. So, and that's why February 2022 is in my number nine. At number eight, April 2022, one of the best month for movies. And yes, and so does the Final Four on the NCAA. And I almost forgot about last good things in March 2022 was the March Madness. 
It looks really awesome, isn't it? So let's continue number nine. So, I saw Sonic 2 in XD at Cinemark with my family, and it was an amazing experience to see it this April. And so does the bad guys in D-Box at Cinemark with my family. And I could see my little brother's favorite movie of all time, and it was really that awesome. Just as awesome. So yeah, including riding the carnival rides at Burnett, Texas, look really awesome. I stay calm really well, and so does Coachella. Yeah, bringing back to Coachella. And that's why I put April 2022 for my number eight. At number seven. Oh boy, we're talking number seven in here. So, number seven, May 2022. So, did I just watch? Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers, the movie on Disney Plus. What an awesome movie that I just watched. And the 40 years of my mom, she looks really awesome, indeed, to taking care of with my mom. And in Garage Fear at Flukerfield, we have Luca. Ah, yes, yeah, so awesome, isn't it? And one tear in my eye, which is crying. At least crying is way better than temper problem. So I have no anger problems whatsoever. For my May 2022. And so does we went to swimming at the Memorial Day. Looking really awesome. And yes. And that's why I put May 2022 for my number 7. At number 6. June 2022. Oh boy. That I saw Lightyear in IMAX at Bullock Museum with my family. And it was an amazing experience. What a blast! And more movies in Garage Beer at Flukerville. So awesome. And a summer vacation trip to West Texas. That looks awesome. This is more awesome than it looks. Uh, yes. Staying calm every 24-7, 365. Yes. And that's why I put June 2022 for my number six. Number five, July 2000 and 22. Ah, yes. This is awesome. We have Minions to Rise of Gru in IMAX at Regal that I just saw with my family. Looks awesome. The Independence Day Fireworks Show. So awesome. Christmas in July Relatives. So awesome. And including DC League of Super Pets that I just saw in Dolby Cinema at AMC with my family. It was amazing. No temper problems whatsoever. And that's why I put July 2022 for my number five. At number four, August 2022. Even better than the other three months of summer 2022. So, we have no temper problems whatsoever. That I saw E.T. in IMAX at Bullock Museum with my family, and it was amazing. Oh boy. And more swimming to do every summer. Oh boy. Even better than the ones from last year. And even better than the ones from summer 2021. Oh boy. And this is the main and this is the main reason why summer 2022 is the best summer ever. Even better than summer 2020. So, and that's why I put August 2022 for my number four. At number three, October 2022, which is the Halloween relatives that I just watch every single R-rated horror movies in this Halloween. And so does Trick or Treating. Yes. And no temper problems. Yes. And so, and that's why October 2022 for my number three. At number two, November 2022. Oh boy, with my Disney relatives, so awesome. Thanksgiving parade, amazing. Thanksgiving food, delicious. And uh, all kinds, including Strange World and Dolby Cinema at AMC with my father, awesome. And no anger problems whatsoever in my taste. So, 
And that's why I put November 2022 at my number two. And now finally the number one, my number one favorite month of 2022 is no other than December 2022. We have no temper problems, awesome Christmas relatives, and for my awesome Christmas presents, for my Christmas update, if you have not seen my update, check for my YouTube video, for my YouTube channel, and Avatar The Way of Water in IMAX 3D at Bullock with my father. It was amazing, and a New Year's Eve, sweet. So, and that's why I put December 2022 for my number one favorite month of 2022. And that's my ranking all 12 months of 2022, which is least to best. Tell me, what is your ranking of these lists? So, let me know in the comments. And stay tuned for tomorrow is my full thoughts on 2022. If you want to see more videos to my channel, click subscribe, click the bell button if you want to see more messages, notifications, whatever you like. Thanks for watching, and until next time, goodbye.